how do we know how a triceratop walked? Well, the answer is we don't. All we can do is make a guess based on the best available evidence that we have. And our specimen represents a really good piece of evidence because it has so much of its skeleton preserved. And when it was found, all of the bones were found in position where they would have been when the animal died. Our specimen lends evidence to the idea where its back legs were very straight and its front legs were a little bit crouched. From the bones in its hands and its feet, we can tell that Triceratops walked on four toes with its back legs, but only three fingers on its front legs, which is what gives it this really weird movement that is really distinct from animals alive today. Once we have the posture sorted, we next have to figure out how big was each step that Triceratops took. And the best way to figure this out is from fossilized footprints that were left behind by an animal as it walked millions of years ago. So what these footprints tell us is that Triceratops walked with its hands further apart than its feet. So this is what gives it that partial push-up, slightly crouched look to the front of its body. So we're never gonna be able to confirm whether we got this walk right. The only way we'd know is if we could get in a time machine and travel back 67 million years and actually watch a Triceratops walking. Wouldn't that be amazing? 